<laughs> okay, so Anthony and, I, Anthony and I just finished eating at another overpriced restaurant. Um, the food was okay. Like, I think if you saw my story, the iced tea was probably my favorite thing out of everything on the menu there. Um, they should do spiked iced tea. Like, I don't know why restaurants don't do that. Like, they would make so much more money, but... Anyways, so we're gonna go today to do a hike. I don't know if it's gonna be hike or more of a walk, but we're going to do something called the secret waterfall. And there is a waterfall at the end, apparently, that you can swim in, so that is our go-to plan. We're also going to do some laundry because you can't wear the same thing in this heat six times in a row, that's just kind of gross. Um, yeah, so we will check back in in a bit. All right, so here we are, laundry ready to go. We are packed. Also, I got my nails done and I'm not really sure how I feel about them. I paid 50 Canadian dollars for them and um, I think they're cute, but I'm also like not sure like what do you guys think? Are they cute? The details. It's supposed to be a koi fish, but everyone's saying it's a ghost, so yeah. Whatever. <laughs> okay, we just got to our drop-off point. Um, we are just waiting for Ashley, and we have no idea how far this hike is going to be. No idea. But, but and it's yeah. already raining, so yay. Thankfully, there's a lot of street cover though. We can't even feel the rain right now, so. <laughs> we made it for about two seconds. <laughs> And my phone's already wet, and we are, I don't even know if we're going to be doing this hike. It's f***ing soaking wet already. <laughs> okay, so our secret waterfall hike didn't really turn into a secret. <laughs> it's, um, I don't know. <laughs> we don't really know where we're going, slash the spot was kind of like, um, blocked off, so <laughs> it just downpours, and the water rises on the falls when it downpours. So it depends on how deep the rapids are. Really fast, like if you go, you're going. I just got my <laughs> guys, but you know what? There's so many monkeys in the trees right now. It's this trail is only for circus people. <laughs> Which is us, obviously. We're crazy. They've got some, um, some little, uh, I don't even know if it's there, but it's something there. But yeah, there's like monkeys. I don't know if you can see them now. There's but there's, there's literally monkeys. It's a brand new face. All the mo all the branches that are moving up there are monkeys. Oh, it's so sick. <laughs> We've seen like families of them. <gasps> what? I just I see them. I see them. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna cross and do another little adventure. We'll see where the f leads us. This is so slippery. But that's what we live for, baby. We live for adventure and lightning. So we made it somehow. But we literally like scaled and climbed all of this. I know it doesn't like look like much, but this turned not into a path and we were like, just basically holding on to the sides of like branches at one point because whatever. 
this guy was kind enough to help us out to guide us which direction to go to, thankfully, because otherwise we probably wouldn't have found it. Yeah, the rapids are pretty, going pretty fast, so, you know. And it's still thundering a little bit, but, um, so pretty. Got water on my camera. And yeah, it's so nice. But a lot of garbage. Okay, so I couldn't film the waterfall because it was around the corner and to get there you had to climb rocks in the side of the um, the like the side of the rock face. And so there were three waterfalls around the corner. It was so beautiful. And this guy was helping us out and we ended up actually going on the other side of the um, river because he advised us against going the way we came because it's more dangerous and whatnot so he brought us to a i don't know if it's a temple but it's a ceremony sacred area so we are here to bathe and just clean off because now we're obviously full of mud and i just wanted to show you guys how beautiful and peaceful this place is And like really guys, pictures don't do any of this beautiful jungle any justice, like genuinely. So beautiful. And then this area right here this is our bathing area. I'm assuming this is where they do their offerings and stuff and they get cleansed in the water here is what they truly believe in. I know, look at this. Look at the flow. <laughs> so pretty. All right, hey guys, so we just made it back to our Airbnb. So after our time at the retreat center, we actually ended up going to dinner with our friend Gama that we met. And he didn't want to be filmed, so I respectfully put the camera down and I put it away and we had an intimate conversation about life and it was just really nice and refreshing and talking about his story and his life and how he grew up. 
So yeah, and now we're back here. Tomorrow we are going to the rice paddies and then we're going to see the parade followed by Nappy Day. And tomorrow I will explain in a video all about Nappy Day and what that is all about. And shout out to our friend Kevin who recommended to do this hike because without you we would have had this experience. It was absolutely amazing, super spontaneous, and yeah, we just never would have done it if we hadn't kept at it. So what actually ended up happening with the whole hike situation is that the trail's not actually marked and there's two sides to get to the waterfall. And the one side is actually blocked off and the other side is just more difficult to get to. We ended up swimming and, you know, hanging off the side of rocks and trees in order to get to the falls. So I couldn't actually film a majority of it because my camera is not waterproof. So I couldn't film a lot of it, but it was actually so nice. It was so beautiful and, you know, just reconnecting with nature and being part of life and feeling alive again was such a nice experience. And then we never would have met Gama. You know, if we hadn't done all that and gone through all that. And honestly, the best experiences in life that I've had are the most spontaneous ones. And I'm so happy that we did that. So thank you, Kevin. That was an amazing recommendation. And thank you everyone again for tuning in and following and sharing and, and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate it. I, it really helps me out. So thank you so much guys and I will see you guys tomorrow.